So New Ship Sydney is the third uh, Hobart class destroyer built uh, in Adelaide for the Royal Australian Navy. It brings with it an amazing air warfare capability uh, when you combine the Aegis combat system with the spy radar, the ability to uh, sanitise airspace to an extremely long range but also to be able to affect uh, the targets that you find in that airspace with the weapon systems that we have on board uh, provides us with a capability that we simply have not had in the past in this organisation. Uh, New Ship Sydney provides uh, an all-round surface combatant capability, not just their warfare, but also surface and anti-submarine warfare. It's amazing to bring a ship into Sydney Harbour at any time, but to bring a brand new ship, uh, particularly one with the history and the legacy behind the name HMAS Sydney, uh, is an amazing feeling. So I think the entire crew felt quite privileged to be part of that today. It feels great to be part of the commissioning crew and to be a part of the Sydney legacy. A lot of work has gone behind it, about a year of our training, and to finally come through the heads was a great experience. It was a real team effort to get the ship to this point where it's been delivered to Sydney, built in Adelaide uh, by the Air Warfare Destroyer Alliance. Uh, you, we, we contracted uh, TK Shipping uh, to do a lot of the testing and trials while the ship was at sea, and uh, the crew were provided by New Ship Sydney uh, crew. Uh, to assist uh, with those trials and to operate the systems uh, while we had to transit the ship up to Sydney. It's an excellent example of the ability of the Defence Force to work with industry uh, to be able to produce a world-class product and to deliver it to the Royal Australian Navy.